The war against malaria, the leading killer disease, moved a notch higher with the announcement of successful clinical trials of a vaccine for children, the group that is most vulnerable to the disease. After going through two separate phase trials, results found that the vaccine, known as RTSS vaccine, done in Kenya and Tanzania, had a promising safety and tolerability profile. It reduced the risk of contracting malaria by 53% in children aged between 5 to 17 months over an 8-month follow-up period. As a scientist, I never thought that I, in my lifetime I'll see a vaccine trial a phase three vaccine trial that has the potential of saving such number of lives. So to me personally as a scientist and as a Kenyan, I think this is a dream come true. In Kenya, the trials are taking place in Kombewa in Kisumu, Siaya and Kilifi, which have high malaria incidence and 90% bed occupancy. The project is overseen by the Kenya Medical Research Institute, Kemri, the Walter Reed Project, the Center for Disease Control in Kenya, Glasgow Smith Klein and Welcome Trust. It, it would be an extraordinary uh, result if phase three did show what we hope it will show. That is uh, efficacy against the clinical disease, efficacy against severe malaria, uh, and uh, hopefully efficacy against mortality uh, due to malaria or overall mortality. Forty years, people have been trying to develop a malaria vaccine. And here we are, we have started the last phase, the phase three, means the last step before the use. We've never been so close to a malaria vaccine. The phase three trial for the vaccine is currently underway and if it shows final clinical success, data will be submitted to regulatory bodies, both international and individual countries, to allow it to be introduced in the market. But the trials may take three to five years before the vaccine finally hits the world market. With a level of efficacy of 50% or 55% as we've seen in the phase two, that simply, it's simple math, it would mean uh, saving hundreds of thousands of lives. Meanwhile, Kenya is hosting the world's largest malaria conference, bringing together over 2,000 malaria experts. Among the main areas that the meeting will be focusing on is on research to eradicate malaria. Mwendwa Kyogora, KTN Weekend Prime.